it is Eurofian's login page you have to give your user id and your password so we have done login successfully so instead of my account i want to impersonate with one of our client how the websites look like client what all the things client can able to do it in eol so now i'll impersonate with one of dummy client So the account is belongs, belongs to test Venky. so he can check his profile here so your profile edit your profile change your password and terms of use so what are the terms and condition you accepted in the login website before signing in those will be available here the privacy policy and cooking policy also you can able to read it here so first I will check with your profile test Venky, mr. test Venky, user ID is test Venky. what is the email ID and languages and he is having the owner of two accounts one is a Bangalore another one is a Gurga the same way client suppose if you are having any multiple units so all the multiple units you can be added it in a single website so all the uh, reports all the samples with respect of all the unit you can check it in a uh, your account so I will click on to the home so how the home page will look like there is a plus symbol add widgets here you can add it your recent sample recently validated sample any to do list or notepad that also you can add it you can check there are menu so are available here one is ordering another one is results another one is reports another one is documents and accounts then support your profile so we will check one by one so first I will going to explain about ordering model so click on ordering model you will get a number of sub menus so first one is a create new order order from favorites download submission form upload submission form view pending order view validate order etc etc so before placing the order you should get the official quotation from European sales or sales support team so once you got that official quotation all the quotation you can able to view it here so click on view quotation there are two accounts that account is linked so I will take as a Bangalore the next actually it is a dummy account so that we have added many quotations here for clients generally it will be there couple of quotation either two or three quotation only so you have to click suppose I am clicking on water testing so it is a dummy quotation so that we didn't added any price suppose if you are quotation all the test test codes and the price will be available for us suppose I am going to order the packaged drinking water or any other in inlet water So the same way food also the food quotations will be here pesticide ILC dummy quotation so many quotations available here so we have to check which quotation you are going to place the order so now we will go and start about that ordering so ordering create new order you have to select your client so order template food we have to select then create so your order name your order reference order name uh, which one you can able to easily track either month wise or batch wise if you have any batch name generally order reference will give us a PO number or PO name your order name might be any projects or month wise whatever it is so quotation have to you have to select any one quotation simply I am selecting analysis zero for analytical service contract default it will come IR so quotation expired date also you can see the project is not mandatory 
then click on next so here order sample your sample code is mandatory suppose your sample code is a1 if you want if you have any barcode will write then sample appearance not required sample name is a mandatory you have to type on sample name then how much quantity you are sending what kind of packing so you want to add another sample add sample sample A2 then coffee powder again quantity 200 grams and same poly pack suppose you want to add another information which is not captured here uh, either batch number or any other information you want to capture it in analytical report there is a small pop-up will be there in each sample so we have to add it suppose batch number you want to capture in that along with the report batch number a123 or batch code any other information it will be captured actually it is a free text you can type whatever it is so you want to add the same sample you will repeat again then you will make it as a favorite uh, again the same kind of things you want to copy it another two sample that also you can make a copy number of suppose you want to make another two copy of samples in coffee powder so it will become here so here a222 then a23 by mistakenly you have added another one sample then you can have the option to delete it suppose A4 you don't want you, you can delete it okay now you can go for the next here the quotation will be available so here it is mentioned as a package heavy metal now here that uh, name they have uh, name they have mentioned as a wrongly actually it is not a heavy metal suppose some analysis so in that analysis first first sample is a tea sample another one sample is a coffee sample so those information you can able to he hear itself suppose here sample you want only a aflatoxin just make a tick mark here then sample here too you want bricks analysis then you have to make a tick mark here suppose both the sample you want analysis for example pH then you click on pH here so it will take for all both samples sorry it's a package so pH for taking both sample it will take the same way you can add it suppose the same test you will repeat again then you will make it as a favorite it will be there in a favorite list then next is a final one so order commands so you can check the details before placing or before confirming the order suppose to first sample a1 what is our European sample code what is the sample what is the quantity and polypack so first sample you want only two analysis of flotaxin and pH second sample you want bricks and pH suppose you want to mention some limit I want a flotaxin within this limit I want uh, heavy metal within this limit then you have the option to edit it again just click on edit so here there is three lines will be there there you have to click on suppose aflatoxin b1 you want or ph what is the expected range those information you can give suppose you want aflatoxin less than 0.5 So here will be there estimate value of flotoxin point one B1 point five B12 sum of all of flotoxin B1. The same way many metals or other or test will be there. Those test estimate limit also you can give it by EOL order. As of now I'm uh, now I'm going to save the order instead of confirming. So just click OK. 
now the order is saved so what are that saved order we call we will call it as a pending order you can go and verify it in view pending orders so this is the order project or month this number now we have placed so again i'm clicking here next 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 so here there are two ways uh, after sending the sample you may give your logistic reference also like airway bill number or another things also you can save it here or if you want any other order commands like the sample should be stored in within this many temperature or less than uh, minus 5 degrees celsius or you can keep it at 24 hours those kind of general information also you can give it in order commands so now you everything is verified or if you want to edit you can go and edit in pending order everything is correct then you can confirm the order if you are confirming the order the order it will come to lab within 15 minutes if you want you can print out this order you can send along with the sample or there is option to send email if you are clicking on that email box this order will go to the consent person Suppose there so consent European person you have to send so only you have to place the UOL order code along with your sample once place the order the email sorry once you send that email that email will come like this in the form so what is your order code what kind of sample you are sending to us all the information commands batch number or batch code all the information will be captured based on this information our team will register so you have to send only this sample reference number along with your sample so now we have successfully placed the order so what are the validated orders you can go and check it here so now we have project and month this order we have validated it means it's locked so once we have imported it will say as imported once it is validated then it will show us as validated okay only this much about ordering model how we can place the order through eol so next step we'll go and check how we can place the sorry how we can check the results in eol so click on results so all the results numbers it is coming here so first one is reference reference code and sample code when is the reception date when is the expected date what is the sample description what is the sample reference sample validation date or any sample status and analytical report so before clicking here just click on the views there are three views one is a report view second one is a result view third one is a sample view report view suppose five samples or ten sample all ten sample also we can issue in a single report so might be that scenario you will get only one report in this view in sample view you will get all the ten samples results the same way in result views the results individually you will get it now single sample registered with a 10 test so all 10 test results will be there individually here so we will check one by one first i am clicking on the report view so there is a filter option here you can check filter and check your sample uh, number so it is showing from 2017 just i am charting again so again i want to click once again so all 2016 sample sorry 2019 sample it is available here so you can check example you take the sample 1 uh, 260 2019 uh, 60 is a lab code 260 means Delhi 258 means Bangalore the sample is registered after that 2019 is calendar year after that 03 is a month so your sample is 50, uh, 582 the same way it's registered 58190 like that so reception date 28th march and expected result is april 6 sample description is semalic infant formula the sample validate on 4th april the sample status is validated 
the analytical report the PDF it is available here it means so what are the reports we are sending through email that same you can download it from here suppose I'm clicking on the analytical report the page will be downloaded here save and open so this is the report which is we are sending to you through email the same you can able to download it here example one is a protein what is the result and total fat what is the results uh, and you want to compare couple of reports like I am selecting three or four reports you want to compare then click on here there is a compare sample now I have selected only four samples there is a compare sample option will be there test and parameter either row or column wise you can export it in Excel So first sample is 579, some mango bite candy. Second sample is oil sample. 581 is a chewing gum. 582 is a infant. So what is the results? It is for, you can check it in Excel. The same way you can compare couple of now I have compared only four samples. The same way you can compare for the calendar year or six month or per quarter also you can compare. So now we will go for the result view. So result view again individual test will be added here in search it is taking only 60 days now I want to take for the calendar year or one quarter from Jan 1st to till date search so, so many analysis results came suppose I want to check only lead results just to type on lead and enter so you may get all the lead results for Jan 1st to till the date so select all again you have the option to export option to export so now all the sample numbers and what is the analysis results so those information also will get you then you can analysis what is the lead range of your sample is failing or what is the range you are getting on samples the same way again I will go for search here there is option called the clients suppose he can select now I have selected two clients uh, if you are the owner of five units or ten units like unit wise also you can check and search it the same will it will come again sample view so again with respect to what is the sample what is the status so all information it will show it here So tools, suppose you want to only number of sample details you want to get, select all, again export it in Excel. So as of now, I have explained only the basic information or basic knowledge about EOL websites, how you can place the order, the same way how you can check your results through online itself. So reports will be its a separate part, once you are getting few of reports in your EOL, then I will go and explain about reports. Thank you.